Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill. And no, this is not a review. This is just a well overdue inner collection room, one collection room video. We're going through my collection room as of 2021 in the main, in the room between my room and the uh, boiler room. So first we got my Imaginex Batcave complete with uh, Batmobile and Batman in the driver's seat. Nice figure. Got this cannon thing that came with the Batcave. It's basically a complete Batcave. Next we got my big Iron Man plush. One of my Spider-Man gloves. On this hand thing of thing of my sister's I found in the garage. Here we got my random Disney figures in one plush. Got some more random plushes right here. They're all Disney. Some of them are Disney, one is Spongebob, one is Sonic, and one is the Grinch. Yeah, and some My Little Ponies in there too. They were adorable when I picked them up from the thrift store. Here we got my random Disney fast food figures. And one remote control Mickey Mouse wagon car thing. We got Lightning McQueen back there. My favorite car from the movie Cars. Of course, we got some Halo, some Halo Spartans, and my Halo Master Chief. And that's my Mega Bloks Halo plus my Halo Infinity figure. Next on the list, we got my random action figures. We got um, a weird robot dude. I don't know his name. I think it was one of those figures to get it like um, Dollar General or something. We got Billy Blaze from Rescue Heroes. I remember that show from when I was a kid. Katara from Diamond Selects from Avatar. We got a couple Scooby-Doo's. We got a Voltron Lion Happy Meal toy up there. We got some Paw Patrol because I like Chase because he's adorable. That's the only reason I own two of them. Probably the only reason, reason I own any of those. Because he's adorable and he's a cute little dog. We got the Pit Droid from Star Wars Episode 1. We got some uh, Lego... Figures. We got Gandalf, Lego Dimensions, Batman, Wild Style. We got Emmett. We got the Ninja. We got a Purple Reaper from Imaginex. We got a Viking from Playmobil, Pirate, TV Guy, and of course, my all time favorite character, Mega Man from NT Warrior. And some Lego Harry Potter. Some weird alien and robot dudes. Some Mega Bloks Power Rangers Samurai. <laughs> some of those weird knight dudes. I don't know their names. We got a lot of different figures. We got those weird soldier dudes from Dollar General, I think. We got Craigert from Legends of Chima. Bionicle figure. And we got that one Knights figure, I forget the name of the line. And a knockoff that reminds me of Ninjor. And that weird Super Sentai robot. We got the Captain Rex ATTE back there. Dollar Tree Ninja. I like ninjas. Of course, we got my Requester Girl swimsuits in there because they're adorable. Rick from Walking Dead, Frodo, Lord of the Rings. The very first Nutcracker, my sister April, not April, but not Melanie, but Jenny gave me that. Reboots Andrea. That mech suit from Avatar, which is really nice. And now we're going to go down a shelf because we've shown off everything. Of course, a little Ben 10 thing there. Here we got my G.I. Joe, real American hero. G.I. Joe is there. 
fighting for freedom wherever there's trouble over land and sea and air. Sorry, I couldn't help but sing the song from G.I. Joe. And I got a, some Cobras, I got some Joes, I got a Snake Eyes mask there. And now for the next shelf, which is my favorite line of all time, it's Bakugan. What are you gonna do? Gods are stacked against you. Back against the wall. Gotta give it your all. Oh, 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 oh. This is the final stand. Oh, 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 oh. The power's in your hands. Two worlds collide. Sorry, I couldn't help the song because I got a lot of Bakugan. That's my entire collection of everything Bakugan. Next, we got my DC shelf. We got my Hall of Justice from Imaginex. We got my villains. We got Gorilla Gron. Um, Solomon Grundy. A guy that reminds me of Gentleman Ghost from Imaginex. And a guy reminds me of King Shark. We got Batman. A couple Batmans. Got Batman's in here. We got Blue Beetle from Batman, the Brave and the Bold, Green Lantern, another Batman, and a custom javelin I made out of Lego. Because what would the Hall of Justice be complete without that? Next over here, we got my Batmobile and my Batcave, which does light up, which is pretty cool. For the bat computer. Bat armor. Got another Batman. We got my Batman the Brave and the Bold Joker Happy Meal figure there. And of course, McFarlane Harley Quinn. Because she's Harley Quinn. She's a hardcore hammer wielding lady. <laughs> Next, we got some of my Clone Wars stuff in here. We got some 501st down here. Some speeder bikes, Admiral Ularin, a couple clones, a medical droid, an astromech, a Republic cruiser, and one heavy cannon, and my ATTE. And it makes noise. All forward positions are advancing. Approaching droid perimeter. We are undetected. All units, fire at will. All units attack. I pressed the button again, sorry. And it makes a lot of noise. And that's all there is to say for that first Clone Wars shell. Next, we got my favorite line from my childhood. It's Toy Story. And I'm moving some stuff around, so sorry about those Shonen Jumps piled up right there. And next, we got my old school Bionicle. Yeah, I collect Bionicle. It's a hobby. And we got stuff from Bionicle 3 Web of Shadows, Legends of Metro Nui, Bionicle Mask of Light, and a lot of Bullrock. We got Bullrock, we got a Vizorak. We got the Rock Chi in the back, and some custom Toa I made. And we got a random, my third random Star Wars shell. We got Baby Yoda. We got Millennium Falcon tin up here. And the Mando's mask. Star Wars vintage tin. A Star Wars bank, Darth Vader, R2-D2 tin. Some random Christmas Lego minifigures. And of course, my Star Wars Episode One trash can. And the last for this area we're gonna do is my Halo Covenant, right next to my video games. And that's pretty much all the Halo I have right now. If you like this video, make sure to like, make sure to comment if you want me to do another collection video. But I'm still working on filling some of the shelves. But this shelf, why it's empty, it's because I'm going to make a Harry Potter collection right here. That's the plan. And this is Eddie Hill. 
moving on and rock on and rock out.